My name is David McRae. I'm a general surgeon. I'm an MD and I work for San Juan Health Partners General Surgery. Varicose veins, the term means a vein that's enlarged, and they're large veins. They may consist of veins just within the skin, which are referred to as spider veins or telangiectasias, uh, or they may be the larger veins, which are the ones that are more visible from a distance. The symptoms most commonly are some heaviness in the legs, aching pain along the distribution of the veins, um, and the symptoms tend to be worse after prolonged sitting or standing. The larger varicose veins now, we've uh, developed techniques to treat those again in the office um, with much less pain, much less discomfort, much less time off work uh, by a uh, laser technique where we insert a laser fiber in the veins and uh, cause the veins to scar down from inside. The technique is referred to as abbreviated EVLT. It's done just under local anesthesia. Uh, they can get up and go home. The most common complaints afterwards are some pain along the vein and some bruising. But we encourage people to get back to normal levels of activity as quickly as they can. So the success rate is about 98%. About 2% of people we can never get in the vein properly. So it does happen, but it's unusual. And the rate of success of, of getting that vein to scar down is close to 100%. Not everyone's candidate for it. First of all, we want to, well, the, the assessment starts with a, an examination in the office. So we see what type of veins are involved, what the symptoms are, what the physical findings are. And the next step is a screening with ultrasound to make sure that the deep veins in the leg have not been um, occluded by a clot in those veins. If they have, we need those more superficial veins for return to the uh, blood out of the legs. Well, it's something we're excited about. We've been doing it uh, in this area for several years and with excellent patient outcomes and high level of patient satisfaction. And, and that's a result of uh, the uh, less invasive nature of the procedure as well as carefully selecting our patients and you know, making sure they're good candidates for the procedure ahead of time. Um, and patients have been extremely happy with it.